Hey guys, Trevor with eCommerce Paradise. In this video, I'm going to review KW Finder, which is one of my favorite keyword research tools available online today. KW Finder is awesome. It's available right now for free trial if you go to ecommerceparadise.com slash kwfinder. So go there, click the link in the description below, get signed up. I'm actually gonna show you how to go about doing that right now. I'm also gonna show you what it looks like to do keyword research with KW Finder and I'm going to give you an idea of how you can improve your e-commerce business by using these keywords that you find. So let's get into the video. All right, so here we are. When you type ecommerceparadise.com slash kwfinder into your browser, click the link in the description below, you'll find this website. So um, this is where you get started. And basically, in order to get started, you'll just have to click uh, Find Keywords. And it's going to tell you to sign up for an account. And the account sign up process is really simple. And uh, just go about doing that. And then we're going to research the keyword electric bike. I want to kind of give you an idea of what it looks like to do keyword research for high ticket dropshipping. This is an example of a high ticket dropshipping niche. This is actually one I used to sell a lot of back in the day. And so um, e-bikes are really popular. They're also trending up quite a bit right now. And so it's a great niche to get into uh, regardless of uh, what you've been selling online. So let's take a look. So what it does is it tells you relevant keywords first and foremost. Okay, and they're uh, broken down um, by the keyword and then by the search volume, the trends, the cost per click, the uh, PPC competition, and the keyword difficulty in the organics. And then you'll see over here that there is a SERP overview, and that shows you the listings that are on Google, the first page, and you'll see who's ranking and um, their domain authority, their page authority, their citation flow, their trust flow, how many external backlinks they have, Facebook shares, link profile strength, and estimated visits per month. So lots of cool data you can look at. All right. And then, of course, you can change to just look in the United States instead of all over the world. If you're selling just in the U.S., you'll definitely want to do that. So what you can do is you can click any of these columns, and it will sort by ascending, uh, or click it again to sort by descending. Oh, well, that's descending, ascending. So electric bike is first, then mountain bike is next. You see 89,000 searches per month for just that keyword, which is great to see. Um, go down a little bit to a subcategory of electric dirt bike. You see there's 27,000 searches per month, which is awesome as well. Um, Electric moped, 12,000 searches per month. Hybrid bike, electric mountain bike, almost 10,000 searches per month. And all of these, almost all of them, are trending up, as you can see. And uh, trends are a great thing to look at because that will help you understand how a product category is selling, okay? And it is the end of summer in October, and it's still trending up, which is awesome. So lots of sales are coming through. People are making lots of money. And um, if you want to make money in a growing niche, this is definitely a great one to be in because the technology is improving. So KW Finder, that's how you would go about finding those. And if you want to um, dig down deeper, you can click any one of these uh, keywords and we'll tell you the SERP overview of that particular keyword. And if you want to export these, you can just click all, export to a CSV or clipboard, and it'll actually give you all these keywords and you can improve your website with those. Now, if we know that, you know, bicycling.com it's ranking number one for that keyword. We can find more cool stuff they're ranking for by searching by domain. And this will give you an idea of what they rank for. Okay, go by search volume. You see Tour de France is one of their main things they get traffic with. Bicycle, bicycling, bike racers, shop for bikes, climbing the hills, race. So, you know, that's a great thing to go with because you'll be able to understand better uh, what kind of keywords you should be trying to target on your website in particular articles. So let's just say you sell uh, electric, folding electric bike. Sell these guys. Oops. So if you type that in and then you go like this, you'll see for that particular keyword what relevant keyword searches there are for it. Still very low competition sites that you can definitely outrank on the search here, which is awesome. And, uh, you know, if you wanted to take a look and see what um, this review site is ranking for, uh, you know, you can go by that. Fat E, I don't know what that is, but bike electric, high bike, electric bike, bicycle, blah, 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 blah. So, 
great tool to use. Now, if you click over here, you'll actually see that Mangools is the main company, and KW Finder also has a bunch of tools underneath it. So you can use their SERP Checker, SERP Watcher, Link Miner, Site Profiler. Link Miner is actually really cool. It's one of my favorite ones um, because you can get an idea of all the backlinks that a particular website has going to it. So if we look at that one website we just looked at, we can find their backlinks. And if I had a review site or an e-commerce site in the electric bike niche, then I would look at this website's backlinks and I would say, hmm, let me try to figure out how to get those same backlinks. So I would see canecreek.com. I would maybe email or call these guys and be like, hey, I'd like to do a, you know, um, a blog post or a, a podcast or YouTube video where I, I, you know, feature you guys and you guys can post that on your website or something like that. Or how can we do some sort of content collaboration so I can help you guys improve your business? Okay, and then you would try to get a backlink from their website to yours. That's basically how that works. So there we go. All right, well, I hope you enjoyed this KW Finder Review YouTube video. And if you're interested in signing up, again, you click the link below. It's ecommerceparadise.com slash kwfinder. Get started today improving your website for conversions. And um, a great way to do this is just by creating more optimized product pages that have the keywords in them that you want those product pages to rank for. Not just the long tail keyword, but also the category keyword, other um, relevant keywords, otherwise known as LSI keywords, and keywords around your niche and the brands and stuff like that. Okay, so the more keywords that you have in your product pages that are actually related to, key, that are uh, keywords that are getting searched a lot, okay, that will make your page stand out, it'll make it rank better, not only in the organics, but also it'll make it show up better in Google Shopping ads as well with your feed, because Google uses your feed to determine what your product is all about, and a, if a commercial search term should pull your feed up or not. So it really does help. And it helps optimize for conversions as well, because people see the keywords and they understand more about the product that way. So those are all great ways to improve your site. Another great way is to create blog post content around those keywords. Create blog posts. It's really easy. It's really fun. And you can even hire writers to do this for you. And this will pull in traffic organically. Okay. And when you make a blog post or a product page, make a video version of that with a slideshow creator like Google Slides and post that to YouTube and then embed it on your website. And that's going to help uh, with user retention. It's going to help people to consume all the content. Uh, it's going to help your conversion rate. Of course, it's going to bring you more free traffic from YouTube. It's going to rank your pages better. So all those are great ways to improve your website. I highly recommend doing them all. And getting started with KW Finder today will get you on the right path. So get started with the link below, and I'll see you out there in the next video. Take care.